Hello fellow YouTubers, Bear Prepper here. Just wanted to show you the solar attic fan. Got it tilted way up, too far up, but we'll get it down. And that's cooling off the shed, which of course is kind of a mess outside. But I wanted to show you the garden. The uh, white-tailed deer had a field day again. So we decided we had to do something about that. Don't have any of this planted up here still. Until we resolve the issues of the white-tailed deer. Really don't want to waste money planting some more. A little rocky here. What we did was we took some of the fencing. Money's a little tight right now. So we just bent it in half. And then we took... Uh, My daughter helped, so we took some of these, just bent it, and, and stuck it in the ground. Some of them went in the ground, and some didn't. And just kind of trying to hold it in with that. These are the sweet potatoes, as you see. They ate them again. And we think it's not getting enough water, so increased it to 10 minutes in the morning and 10 minutes at night. Because it's just so darn hot. Probably got about six or seven sweet potatoes left. But we know the white-tailed deer are really stressed because they started eating the asparagus. And they don't particularly care for asparagus. This is my grapes. The leaves are just coming back out on them. But the asparagus looks really dry. Hope you can see that. But they've kind of started chomping on them. Then we have four rows here. Another sweet potato. And we'll see if this works. If this doesn't work, then we'll go to the PVC pipe. A lot of asparagus still in this one. Not too worried about it for this year. As long as they stay alive. And this great plant's looking really good. They can probably get to this better than I'd like them to, but not a whole lot we can do about it. Maybe if I stick that up there, keep that leaf poked out, but they're they're growing, sort of. They're trying. Um, had to fill the water tank up once. The uh, results have been, once it gets down to the last foot on the tank, there's not enough back pressure to run the timer. So make sure you don't let it get down. On these tanks, if it's uh, I think this is a, what, uh, 275 tank. So when it gets down to about 82 on a 275 you need to refill it so we refilled it once um, and since it increased the time it's probably gonna have to be refilled every two weeks but it's still working getting ready to increase it for the fall planting so we're hoping this works and give us some something growing if it doesn't, then we'll just hold off this year if we have to, and I'll buy what I need to fence the area in, put a six-foot fence around it, and see if that helps keep the deer out. We don't have a lot of access deer here. It's mostly whitetail, and they usually don't go for things like this, but it's, uh, it's really dry and really hot. This almost killed me. Just putting these on because it's so hot and so humid. So I hope it works. There you go. That's the um, solar attic fan working. Not even pointing at the sun. And look at that bad boy spin. Definitely cooler in here. Everything looks good. Wonderful, wonderful. 
so happy with that. Blessings.